Hey, good morning, Renny. Uh, we are on 55 southbound here, and uh, you heard Monica mention that it's hard to see where the lanes are. That is absolutely the case here. We are just uh, in the Arnold area right now, uh, getting ready to uh, kind of go into the Imperial area as well. Uh, I would say that we've seen trucks throughout the morning, but Moda IDOT is saying it's so hard to keep up just with the amount of snow that is falling. And the big issue also is the blowing snow. That has been a real issue this morning. In fact, IDOT saying that the, the, the wind is killing them when it comes to trying just to keep any kind of pavement showing at all in the Metro East. I have some updates for you though when it comes to uh, numbers with the Missouri State Highway Patrol. They have uh, covered 76 calls for service since midnight. 48 stranded motorists make about, uh, uh, 48 of those have been stranded motorists. 13 non-injury crashes. Here's the good news. No injury crashes and no fatal crashes. That is wonderful news. And I just checked with the Jefferson County uh, Sheriff's Department. They say they only responded to one one accident and it was very minor all morning long so it looks like a lot of folks are staying home working from home had the kids obviously off of school um, one of the things that the Missouri State Highway Patrol says they're dealing with because it's so cold they are actually dealing with um, fuel lines freezing in in large trucks and so they're actually responding to some of those and helping the truckers try to get back on the road and get where they need to go. But this is the very latest now from Jefferson County. It is a very snow-packed area for sure. Uh, that's the very latest. I'll send it back to you guys in the studio. Hey, Ryan, before I let you go, I wanted to ask you, how were you guys able to clear off the windshield? Because earlier you had, you know, frozen pre precipitation on there. Yeah, so what we had to do, we had to pull over and Mighty Joe Young, our photographer, he is also driving, so I'm sitting in the passenger seat, uh, you know, talking through this live hit, but he was able to pull over and really just uh, get those windshield wipers caked, uh, get all that ice that was caked down there. That's the problem, folks. When you go out today, the windshield keeps freezing. You're going to always have constant issues with the windshield wipers. We saw several cars having pulled over on the interstate. That's not advised, but because they couldn't see because the frozen precip on their actual uh, on their actual windshield. But right now, we're in a good spot. Uh, I think maybe the car's been warmed up plenty, so we have, uh, you know, probably a nice hot windshield where the precip's not sticking and freezing. But I, I will tell you, that has been an issue and a constant theme for several cars this morning.